Let's talk pricing. We understand that people don't want to pay unnecessarily for things, but we do want to charge people a fair price for the work along with the value and advice that we give as marketers. And as for many things, when you cheap out on a purchase, you could regret it down the line when it doesn't perform as you wanted it to and have to buy the higher ticket item anyways. We get a lot of questions about pricing and invoicing, so let's talk about nickels and dimes, or rather, tens and hundreds of thousands of dollars you could be spending. First thing to note, does your agency bill by the hour or by value-based pricing? If the agency does bill by the hour, make sure the rate is reasonable. Then have the agency explain how they track their time and what structures are in place to ensure that time is used efficiently. Are there any additional fees? Are taxes included in the estimates? When the agency has value-based pricing, they are charging a set amount for a service. For example, an agency charges $10,000 for developing a marketing strategy. This pricing model is advantageous in that once you agree to that value exchange, you don't have to worry about the price again. However, there is a whole different set of considerations to think about and your organization will need to evaluate if that type of pricing structure works for you and if you're truly getting value for the investment. When it comes to purchasing media, ask if they mark up their costs and what that markup is. What services are being accounted for with that markup? Is it being broken out on invoices or will it be baked in? Once you have chosen your agency and start receiving invoices, make sure you go through every invoice, create a spreadsheet, and compare the invoice to the estimate and to the work actually completed. At the end of the day, you as a client need to know what you're getting for your money. If the agency doesn't want to share details with you, that should be a big red flag. In the client-vendor relationship, there needs to be trust and you cannot have trust without transparency. So go ahead and ask your questions.